So this is a 1v1 exercise. I call it the duel. It's a great exercise for developing players' 1v1 skill sets, getting them to stay on the ball and push them out of their comfort zone. It's fun, it's competitive, and you really see the benefits of this type of work if done regularly. It's a great exercise to do with smaller groups or with individuals at the end of a session. The layout is simple. It's a 15 by 15 yard area split into four quarters with a mini goal in each quarter as shown. The coach is positioned on the outside of the area with a good supply of footballs. Players are split into two teams and take turns competing in 1v1 duels in the middle. The game starts with the coach playing the ball into the area. Players will compete for possession and look to score in any of the four goals. To score a goal, players must be in that specific quarter of the area. If a goal is scored, the coach will play a new ball into that attacking player. If the ball goes out of play, the coach will play a ball into the opposition player. Each duel lasts for one minute and the player with the most goals at the end of the minute will win. This can either be played as an individual challenge or a team challenge in which you add up all of the players' scores. Some of the outcomes from this practice are developing 1v1 skill sets, improving players' resilience and confidence to stay on the ball under pressure, to develop players' strength and endurance on the ball, and also 1v1 defending skills. A couple of really good progressions for this one. To stretch the players further, you can make the players have to travel through at least two of the quarters before they are able to score. That will encourage them to have to stay on the ball for longer and put them under more pressure. The game also works really well as a 2v2 practice. Like I said, this is a great technical exercise to develop players 1v1 overall ability and can be used for every age group and all abilities. I'd love to hear coaches' feedback on this one and whether it worked and if they'd do anything differently.